we are going to make my own camera strap today because we are at Clever Supply headquarters. Todd, get in here. So Todd here is the guy who founded Clever Supply uh, and we thought it would be fun to make my own strap. Todd is gonna walk me through it and we're gonna go from start to finish. Yep, so we're starting with a hide. On a strap. We're starting with the leather hide. Okay. Which is right here. Yes. And you've chosen this leather, which is beautiful. I this love leather it. comes from Italy, which is awesome. Yeah, I don't have this color yet, so I'm yeah. excited. Yeah, so we're gonna use this tool here. This is our strap cutter. Okay. And you're just going to bring it here and you're gonna feed it through here and you're going to start to pull. And okay. we're getting a larger strip. So, so the blade's like here? Blade's here, okay. yep. There's a razor blade here. We're just okay. gonna cut a strip. You're just Done. trying to keep this yeah. lined up with that. Oh, I'm through. scared. Okay, so okay. I'll get it started a little bit and go ahead and just kinda. And then I just hold this. Yep. What's the best? Normally I angle? come this way. So okay. come this way. My instinct was completely wrong. Yep. <laughs> Do you hold this part or hold this part? part? Yep. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's yep. satisfying. <sighs> I feel like I... Oh no, that's pretty good. Yeah, good, yeah. It's getting Come stuck right through. here because yep. there's an angle. Oh boy. A little more. There's like a, a little, little more. Just make it happen. Hold. Make it happen. <laughs> Boom. You got it. All right. <laughs> We're going to take this over to our strap cutter. All right. So you ever use a sewing machine? No. No. So there's a little foot pedal here, like you see on a sewing machine. Oh, fun. Okay. So this foot pedal oh. rotates the blades. Yeah. What we're trying to do is we're trying to just keep feed this straight. piece here, feed, and just kind of keeping this Edge. right there. Okay. Yep. So. If it's getting sketchy, can I take my foot off the pedal? You can take your foot off the pedal. Okay. And we can. Don't uh, your fingers. I know. Okay. And push. Yep. We just kind of feed it through, keeping it straight. Am I doing good? good. Am I doing great. good? It's great. So typically, because we're making lots of straps, we cut quite a few out all at once. So this helps us just to kind of work a little bit faster. That's so cool. Mm -hmm. So then, some future Clever customers are right. going to get a strap I cut. Exactly. Lucky for them. So we've got our piece here. And what's your favorite size of the camera strap that we offer? I le it was like a 28 or a 29. It's like a super shorty. 28. Like That's about it. Here. That's okay. the one. It's a very popular size. Yeah. So we're going to make the one with the neck pad. Is that right? Yes. Cool. So yes. for this one, we're going to cut two pieces of this at 11 and a half inches. Okay. So you can use this blade. Just you like got that. It. You got it. Just straight down or do you do an 11 angle? 11 and a half. Yep. 11 and a half. 11 and a half. So, yep. There you go. That's satisfying. Two. Yep. Eleven and a half. Oh boy. I almost messed that up. Okay. Okay. Boom. So now we're gonna take those two pieces. I'm also gonna grab the hide here. And we're going to cut out a few things. So this is our clicker press. It's the eight ton clicker press. So what it does is it creates a, quite a bit of pressure using these dies to help us cut out our patterns. So we're going to be cutting out a rounded edge, stitch holes, and we're also going to cut out a neck pad. Cool. So you're going to push the green button here to get her started up. Okay. okay. So we put one piece down. We bring this die right the over top. top. Yep. Line it up. We're gonna leave a little bit of an okay. edge there so we can get our nice rounded edge. Yep. And then we'll come here, both buttons to engage. Okay. Whoa. Oh, I'm so excited to do this. So we'll do one more. So We're gonna use this die for the for the top part. It's okay. gonna connect to the neck pad. Same thing. Wow, that looks fun. Okay. Does it matter which side's up? That, that side. side. Yep. How does that look to you? That looks great. I don't want to mess it up. That looks great. Wow. Oh, 
That is fun. Just pull it off? Pull it off. Oh. There's a little scraggly there. Just oh, kind no. of pull it. Perfect. I can just. Yep. Okay, and then the shorty. Like that. You got it. Do that all day. Sick. Yeah. Okay. All right. And now shoulder strap. We need. Yep. The shoulder strap. So we'll get this guy out of the way. Kind of line it up here. Same thing. Same thing. Is it fine at any position? Yep. This is, this Go for it. Because the surface area. You got it. That's it. That's it. How you guys made these? I'm like, are they cutting these with a? Used to by hand. No. At one point, yep. Yeah. The rounded edge and Dang. every single hole. Yep. Yeah. Okay, off. Off. Red button. Red button. Okay. So now we take our All components. Our we're gonna go to the next table over here. And so we're gonna emboss a little logo. So yep. we have a fox here. Yep. That's our. Clever Supply logo. Clever Supply guy. And you'll bring it down just with a mild bit of pressure. So there, and push. What is this called? It's a clicker press as well. It's a manual one. I don't know if that was enough. We're gonna find out. Show. Mm. Okay, wow. that's so cool. Wow, that looks pretty good. He's a cute little guy, look at this little guy. Can you see him? Okay. Then we do the neck pad. Yep. So we have a little guide here. Okay, and then you're gonna that put goes drop down. this in. Similar amount of pressure, okay. a little lighter a little on this lighter. one. Okay. Yep. Wow. Look at that. See what that one is? How'd it look? Hold that up. That looks great. Cool. Now we're pretty much ready to see. Do stitch. you have one that says grain check? I know. I wish. If only. <laughs> Maybe we'll have to work on that. Yeah, that would be <laughs> so cool. Okay, so now right. we stitch. Now we stitch. Oh, okay. All right. This so, I don't know about, Todd. How would you like to do this? Would you like to do the entire thing? I you like think to... you should You should forge the path. Forge the path, get it started. Get it started, show me how we'll... it's done. Cool. Because I have quite literally no idea. All right, cool. So when we're looking at the strap here, we can kind of see this is kind of how we're going to yep. do it here. We're going to yep. need some split rings. So we've got some split rings here. Okay, you're going to put one, kind of just fold and slide it over. Okay. Like so. Okay. And you hand stitch we every hand stitch single strap. Every single camera strap. So by hand. Unreal. Gonna cut out some thread, and yep. so typically we sit, we can stand, we use this tool, it's called a stitching pony. Um, this one mounts to a table, but people used to sit mm. kind of around it and come up like this, so. It's also um, a term, this, this stitch is actually called a saddle stitch. Okay. So we're using two needles, and it was used in, traditionally in the equine industry for making saddles. Wow. So it's uh, super, super strong because the way the stitch is designed is if one breaks, it actually has a locking mechanism that doesn't allow it just to break. So wow. if your stitch breaks, um, it can be totally repaired, but it also won't fail on you. Right. Um, like your camera's you have not time. Gonna... Yeah, yeah, you have time yeah. to actually get it fixed. So we just kind of fold this over here. We have our holes. Line so them up. These holes here line up with this one. Mm -hmm. And then... Bring it here. This just kind of works as an extra set of hands because yeah. you're using both hands to stitch. Right. So you're coming through here. Through the second hole. Yep. Kind of line up. Mm -hmm. And then we go backwards first. This is called a back stitch. It's just kind of a way of making a secure Super stitch. Super strong. And then we go forward. Just in and out. Okay, I can do that. 
Cool. I can do that. Okay, you're gonna have to watch to make sure though. We're gonna make it happen. You got this. Wow, that's crazy. So you can pull the first needle through okay, all the way. Yep. yep. Give yourself some room. Some room. I was like, that doesn't make a lot of sense. Pull the other one through. That's so crazy. You guys hand stitch every single one of these. Or hand make. I shouldn't even say hand stitch. Hand make. Okay. I'm going to just keep this guy in here. Right? Yep, yep, you can kind of rotate it however it, yep, Makes exactly. Sense. So I stitched it. Oh, oh, wow, look at you. I know. That's great. That was just like surprisingly very fun. Do you want to see my stitching? It? Yeah. It does, it was very satisfying. That's like pretty clean. And it was easier than I thought. Yeah, but yeah. now we have these little loosey goosey. We gotta take care of those, don't we? Yeah, so we burn the thread. So I'll do the first one here yeah. for you. So we're going to burn the thread. Okay. This is easier because it's a little bit more control than some of the other lighters out there. So yeah. let's use a basic grill lighter. Okay. Let it go and then kind of push it down. Down, okay. seals it. And this is waxed and it's a polycord thread, so when it burns, it actually just kind of welds right into the right. thread. So that's what it looks like it's doing. It it's kind of it crazy to watch. What happens if the fire mm. is like on there too long? Uh, it'll start to burn the, okay. the leather, and that's not ideal. But Stop there. Perfect. Yep. And just roll it. You got it. Is that right? You got it. Yep. Wow. It. Look at that. There. Wow, custom. That was good. That's cool. Um, That's really cool. Now you have a camera strap. That's it. So what are you going to do with this camera strap? Well, shoot. I was going to put it on like my Polaroid or something, but I don't know. Now I'm feeling like maybe I got to give it away Ooh, to someone. In your next video? That's an idea. Or just in this video. Should we? Should I? I think you should. I think I should. That's a that's a one of one. You know what? What do I you make know what I think do? would be cool? What? I think it'd be cool if someone had you give it to them with it hand signed. Okay, that's fine. What do you think? This is a one of one. Just sign the inside Taylor, with the marker. Taylor Pendleton. I'll do it on the other side. This <laughs> side's the clever supply yeah. guy. This side will be my side. Wait, so you're really giving it away? Yeah. Why not? You just like I already have, you know. Random a few. comment or what? Yeah, yeah, just a random commenter. You can say whatever you want. Okay. So sick. Ready? Here we go. Um, should, should I sign it too, or? <laughs> I, got, I can sign it too if you want. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yeah, let's get so sick. Good. So, Taylor, you can come and help me uh, make camera straps anytime you <laughs> Am want. Am I hired? You're hired. You're hired. Wait, that, that was sick. so fun. That was sick. That Should you put sick. it on a camera real quick and get a cut of that? Yes. All right. Would you look at that? I'm, I'm proud of you. She's handmade. Wow. Yeah, a lucky one of you is going to get sick. this. I know. Honestly, I didn't do too bad. I think mine would have been a little better, but it looks oh, sick. Okay. All right. Peace. Bye.